All right, we're gonna do a little more um, off-season hockey content because I cannot, for the life of me, understand what the New Jersey Devils see in Sheldon Keefe and hiring him as their new coach. Um, when you look at the talent um, that Keefe had in Toronto and the results that he got and the way that he was outcoached in the playoffs in every series that he, that he played a part in, that he led that team, um, I just don't understand how the Devils ran out and hired him as, the, as their next head coach. Now, I don't, I'm not a Devils hater. They have a lot of talent, but I am an Islander fan, so I don't want to see the Devils succeed. Um, I think hiring Sheldon Keefe has, uh, has uh, sealed the deal to, you know, for the Devils. The Devils will not succeed. They will fire Keefe within the next three years, I'm sure, and um, go find you know, a real head coach that can get them um, to the promised land or have a better chance of getting them to the promised land. I don't know, when I see when I see Keith behind the bench, he barely speaks. If you watch the Amazon documentary, I don't know, you know, that was a while back, that was during the, uh, the COVID year. Um, he would let his assistants, it seemed like he'd let all his assistants do all the talking and whenever he was talking to the team, Nobody gave a shit at what he was saying. They were nobody bought into a word that that guy was saying. So I just don't know how he ended up um, with another co head coaching job so soon. Hey, good luck to him. Um, but um, I'd love to know if you have the same thought that I do on the Devils hiring of Sheldon Keith.